Today I'm going to attempt to build a local lead generation website in record time, under 10 minutes. Plus it was while I was recording this video that I discovered Namecheap's new AI website builder, where like anything AI at the moment is not perfect, but it is a fast helper. I went to launch WordPress, clicked on the button, filled in a few details, and suddenly it had my full template filled out with images, headings, and some basic text. Whereas in months before where I tried to do websites like this, there's always that pain of having to try and make the landing page look like a real business and putting in all these different snippets of text and try to make it look like a decent layout, which doesn't take too long, but to do it in one click was far better. And in this video today, I'll show you exactly how I was then able to incorporate long form SEO optimized content that then got this site ranking within a matter of hours. Now, before we go any further, this is just a snippet of a new project I've been following where I've been finding one page websites are working really well. Google has done a pretty good job of clapping down on the old affiliate and niche site model and has made it clear that it doesn't want us to be spewing out thousands of articles of content anymore. So these days, everything I'm doing, all my projects tend to be much more about getting very closely aligned with a product or a business and ranking a single page website, squarely targeting the transactional intent for that keyword. And then it's on the back end of that that we connect up that potential buyer with a potential seller. Now, this is quite a complicated process. The actual SEO side really isn't that difficult. I say that having had seven years in SEO, but I still don't think it's actually that difficult. The real challenge and test comes down to how you form those relationships to actually get those sellers in the first place. Because I can get leads and buyers no problem at all but finding reliable business partners is another matter. However, in the last few weeks, I've made massive strides in how we do that. I am now quite easily able to find buyers in any niche. So that's going to be a key module added to my one-page websites course that will be launching very soon. I know some of you have been waiting very patiently. The fact is I don't want to launch this until it's watertight, until it's high quality, replicable, and literally has a full system in the box to make 10 grand a month. And getting those deals has been a key part of that. And like I say, repeatability, Fair enough, I got a single payment of more than a thousand pounds from one of these sites, but there's always that confirmation bias and basically flukes. So I'm not confident in this technique until I've done it three times. But so far it's looking good. And the aim is to have a cash flow of 10 to 20 grand a month within the next six months. So click the link below, sign up to the pre-launch. If you are on that list, then you'll get access to the free pre-launch where you'll get complete access to the course absolutely free before it becomes a much higher ticket paid offer. So I've changed my mind, I'm gonna do one at a time. So I'm just registering one, and now we'll set this up as the template. Now, generally these kind of local sites do rank very quickly. So once we've got proof this is working, then we can easily add in new sites. Click on manage, and then where it says basic DNS, we want to change that to Namecheap web hosting DNS. So that means we can now go to our hosting list, go to cPanel on the uh, site, the server we actually want to install this on. Now we go to domains. We want to create a new domain. We want to add it in there. We don't want to share the document root. So that allows it to be its own website and then submit. And that just takes a minute. And then we should be able to install WordPress. We will want HTTPS because we'll put it on cloud for there. Make sure the title is correct with the keyword. In fact, I'm going to take out company because we're specifically trying to target Loft Conversions Teddington. We don't want the description and that should be all we need for now. There we go. So now we should be able to log in. So we're going to get this flag that there's no SSL. So we just go to Cloudflare. Once we're into Cloudflare, we can add this as a new site, add a domain, ignore all this and go for the free plan, continue to activation. And it's pretty much always the same name service. And then we do custom DNS now. That means we can now start building. Yes, we can. I don't want this launch. Now let's have a go with the site launcher actually, if it's AI powered. So it's in construction. The name is Loft Conversions Teddington. We want to grow site traffic. It's basically going to be a single page website. This is looking quite exciting actually. I think I'll go with that one. Website description. We provide Loft Conversions in Teddington, Surrey, UK. Should be professional, informative. Let's see what this does. It's installing plugins automatically. Let's see how this does. However it looks, we'll need to check the performance metrics as well. What does it look like? That's not bad. Actually quite like that. So it's given us a basic logo. What happens if we click request a quote? Nothing. So as a basic wireframe, that's really not bad. So if we go to edit page, how easy is it to add our long form text that we need? And this is all, it's actually built in Gutenberg blocks, which is even better. So yeah, we could just add a paragraph block and therefore add our text there. So next we go to Surfair and we want to create a content editor. And we want this to target Loft Conversions Teddington in the UK. That's now ready to go, so we can open that. So 
So with exact match domains, we want to make everything look like the company name is Loft Conversions Teddington. Include the following entities, the number of times indicated after zero slash, and how many words do we need? 1,500. Go. So that's working in the way in the background. Let's see if there's any FAQs we need to include. Yes, there are. Answer the following. So meanwhile, we'll add all this to the Cepha template. So already has a score of 71. So we're up to 74. Now we should be able to ignore auto-optimize and just click on insert terms. So it will now try and add in as many of these terms as possible. There we are. So I just do accept, accept, accept. And save that. So now we're up to 79, which is above the top competitor who is 78, so I'm happy with that. In fact, if we make this a H1, then that would be even better. Yeah, 85, much better. But we actually want to keep it as a H2 because we're going to put it low down in the website. As it's the home page, we already have a H1 on the home page. So now this we can just paste here. So this all looks pretty good. Save that. So now we should be there. So that all looks pretty good. So next we need to actually get it indexed, get it ranking. So best thing for that really is citations. So I found a cheap provider on Legit. And we've got basic at six dollars for thirty. Standard is 15 for 60, so I'm just going to pay the 45 and get the 150. Okay, so at this stage all we spent was around $8 for the domain and $45 for some citations. And we'll continue to check out. Already got a card on there. Confirm and pay. So now we've got to submit our requirements. Meanwhile I'm going to go back to ChatGPT and say write a newsworthy factual non sensationalist press release in fact I'll say SEO optimized press release for the launch so that's going to go away and write that have we now got our requirements submit requirements so we need business name, website address, phone number, contact name, description, services, business hours, and social media profiles. So most of these are not essential. We need business name, website address, and phone number, I think is the standard. So really interesting check-in here. You can see I bought the domain at 3.50 p.m. loftconversionsteddington.co.uk and I've just done a manual Google search Loft Conversion Teddington, our target keyword. And then what's down here? This is my website that I've literally just launched at position nine. So I was only just checking in on that because I've just had confirmation that the press release has gone through. So you can see 8.28 the press release went through. It's now 8.40. I don't think that was related to it though. I think this is because I used Omega Indexer. So I think this is the result without having any backlinks built. So let's see if I refresh this. Has Omega Indexer gone through? There we are, completed 100%, sitemap submitted. So that tells us that this result is without any of the off-page work we've done. It's just super low competition. We've done an optimized page, exact match domain, and we've got it indexed.